Coco. Uh, so we are still in the fighting realm, uh, not boxing though. Going a little bit more to uh, something I think everyone was a fan of in here, which is Dragon Ball Z. Now, of course, Dragon Ball Z has a numerous amount of fighting games. You got so your many. Xenoverse, you got your Budokai's, you got Raditz, Raditz 2, Raditz 3, Raditz 4. The Japanese you have, yeah, you have all of those. Um, you have Raditz Racing, but the one I'm picking today is none other than Budokai Tenkaichi 3. This is this was one of those games that it kept building up to where it was like whenever it was the last one, which of course was Budokai Tenkaichi 3, it was like, oh, this is it. Y'all got everything right. And that's what I feel like Tenkaichi 3 was. For this time, it got everything right. You had all the characters in there from Dragon Ball all the way up to Dragon Ball GT. What I loved about it too was just how you see Goku change, just how you see Gohan change, you could advance all the way up to their tier depending on which saga they were in. So if you had like the Majin Buu saga Goku, you can go all the way up to Super Saiyan 3 and continue to power up. Even Vegeta, you can get to Super Vegeta, Super Trunks. Everything was in here. Even the GT boys, even their specials was dope. I love that you could actually blow up the planet. The planet blows up. In oh, this, that's right. In this and then you guys just keep fighting. <laughs> you know? And I loved it, man. This was this was the this was our Mortal Kombat Street Fighter. This is what this is what the block was on. Like if you could play this, the block challenged you. Do you have somebody else come from another block and was like, oh, so you the best in, in, in Tenkaichi? Who you play with? Don't matter who the fuck I play with. Show up Saturday and you're going to find out. I don't like how the Pataro earrings uh, fuses them. <laughs> I, fall in. I didn't know that that happened. I thought they just put it on and then boom. I didn't know <laughs> Penis Brothers. And then, yeah, was, they yeah. really dick touch. They're like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I was, I was well, like, out of, out of everything to go, like, why y'all didn't just put your arms out? When y'all do it? <laughs> Insert into me so that we can become one. <laughs> it's called docking, I think that's a, the term for that. It's called docking. docking. Yeah. I feel like Goku did it first and he's like, and then just Vegeta was already in the pool. It's like, why'd you do it like this? Like, you went chest first. What are you doing? Goku slides in, he's like, hey, we're Vegito now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You just oh, man. Gogeta. <laughs> oh. It's like if Vegeta oh. is terrified. <laughs> that's why I go. That's why he be in that gravity room all the time. He fucked up. Yeah, bro. He's like, I'm sick of this shit. Yeah, I did man. not know they went to GT though. Yeah, bro. They had everybody in GT. Uh, Hell Seventeen. You had the Shinron Dragons. You had Baby Vegeta, and again, all of them had the power ups. So you yeah, had all the here. specials. You had the fusion. Both the of them are GT right there. Tanks. Who did they? Who did these two at this power level have to fuse into the beat? They had to fight uh, Omega Shinron. So this was the Dragon Balls. They created seven dragons. And so he was the epitome of all the Dragon Balls, the embodiment of one. Jesus. For yeah, and then when they beat double. him, Goku four. became that. That was four, right? That's who yeah. we just saw. That's what we're four, four together, yeah. yeah. Jesus. Super That's Saiyan how strong four. the Omega Shinron was? Yep. Right. Super but the Saiyan only thing four. was, that just like every fusion, it's like they have one writing style and they just copy, paste, copy, paste. He gets super arrogant. He knows how much time he has, but for some reason just keeps slapping him around, blah, 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 blah. And then at the worst moment, it's like, oh, time's up. Yep. And now it's like, we were strong enough, but now, you know, we have no options. Exactly King right. Vegeta's a playable character. Yes, bro. Everyone uh, is in this game. I didn't know that. King Vegeta, King Cold, Cooler, Meta Cooler, the entire cast, bro. Like, even, even, from, even uh, from Dragon Ball, the dude from the Red Army. The Dick general, Henry. he's in here. King Piccolo was in here. Everybody is in here with all of their different transformations, man. It was, if you were the ultimate Dragon Ball Z fan, if you loved all of this, this was the game that you had in your household. This is wherever you see the big pile of bikes, this is what we were playing. Nice. I love it. Yeah, this goes yeah, down to history, man. When it's Dragon Ball, they just can't seem to miss. They just can't. It's just one of those incredible stories that just keeps on giving over and over and over again. Kakarot comes out, and we're playing the same episodes we've seen a thousand times already. <laughs> can't do that's, it, man. That's why I, I didn't get the full like love for 
Budokai 3, because by then we were so like so far into the Dragon Ball Z plot in terms of video games. It was just like, it didn't matter how much the dynamics changed. Like it was just the same, same thing because I used to play Dragon Ball Z games back in the, uh, we had to t get the little spring and the little, like uh, you had to modify it to it's play the mod Japanese games. NPS. Yeah, yeah. And to be honest, like those games were fire. They yeah. had, they had the 2D fighters. They had the, the um, they almost had one that looked like Smash Bros where you were really far away and yeah. you were fighting. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. they had a whole bunch of dope ones. So by the time the, that they were really Americanized, it was just like like Will said, I can't fight Raditz again. Like I, I fought Raditz 30,000 <laughs> times in my childhood. Like by the time it got to three, I think I played it to see like the dynamics and everything, but I just never really got to like immerse myself in it. Right. I mean, we, we literally only got into it because of the characters. When we were just like, yo, they got everybody in here. That That's was the it. only reason why we Did got it. Did you ever it. play uh, Burst Limit? The It was like a... I played Burst one Limit. One-off, like, Dragon Ball Z fighter that it was... It only went up to, I want to say, the Cell Saga, but it was like one of the coldest Dragon Ball fighters to me. Yeah, no, yeah. Burst, Burst Limit's really, really slept on. It's it's a great game. It's, I think only it only it came out for the PS3 and the Xbox 360. It's it was like a one one v one. It was a, it was a pretty good yeah. game. The graphics were cool. The the animation was really was good. Cool. Never but played. then like, cause I want to say Bardock was crazy in that one. That was like that was my character in Burst Limit. Why do games keep trying to make Bardock good? It just it doesn't no. make sense. <laughs> he was fighting henchmen. So they make him so like the truth, and all he all he can he do Goku, is he Goku Daddy though. Daddy, bro. Right. He, come on, he but come on, that come from his loins, man. I made this <laughs> nigga. Bob Kakarot. Yeah, but up. like, you ain't gonna you ain't gonna get Kobe, uh, the original Bean Bryant, in a game and have him crossing <laughs> Kobe up and stuff like that. Like oh, the the son now, was better. The coldest thing to uh, <laughs> right is the uh, the fact that his headband is red. It's blood. It's the blood from like the Saiyans. Like it was That's so his cool. blood. He was getting his ass whooped that whole movie. <laughs> hey, yo. It's the blood of a thousand sands. No, Frieza just split <laughs> no shit open. <laughs> yeah, you be like that. I mean, he's the original Goku hair. You know what I'm saying? That the hair. He birthed Goku. That's oh. the one thing that he did. He got Goku out of there and then took that <laughs> damn beam to the face. Ah, like you couldn't block a Frieza one attack. Well, Frieza was always cold, actually. But yo, uh, man. Hey, yo, I, yeah. I'm so sorry. I just can't unpicture somebody walking up to Kobe Dan and say, "Yo, one up, let's go." <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Come on. Hey, what are you doing? I'm in Whole Foods. You know what this is. You know what this is. I'm beating. I'm beating the Brian tonight. Let's go. <laughs> but if he uh, had skills, the though. graphics are dope. Yeah, no, no, no. The one that the Jess is missing. Yeah. Yeah, I remember was, the first time I cover. I don't think I ever played it, but from these screenshots, I'm trying to remember. Did it play how fighters played, or was it a little bit? It was. It was originally like Budokai. It was like the original Budokai, but brought to a whole new level. Like, yeah, but, but it's not even that because you, as you see, like you're still kind of oh, stuck. Wow. You're still kind of stuck on a camera thing. Like in Bu in Takashi and Budokai, Tukashi, you can literally take off. You can like go on sure. the hold or side of the map. You can't do that. Yeah, in this you, one. That was the other cool thing about Burst Limit. When you would get into the sky and stuff, those, those battles were crazy. Yeah. Like Burst Limit is honestly until Fighters, it was like probably my, my favorite. Oh yeah, Dragon Ball Fighter. I go fast. Anyway. That looks good. But here's the only thing that that really made it made him like be slept on was the fact that everyone wasn't in it. So to come from like Tenkaichi yeah. Three that has yep. a full roster For to sure. well, we're just stopping at sale. No, no, and then just go back to what Pat has continued to say. I'm not fucking fighting Raditz again. No, especially yeah, just I said. I think it came out right after uh, Tenkaichi Three. It so did. It just it had did. everyone, and then the, it had dope graphics, but you only see Cell. He's like. Yeah. That's where the story ends itself. So you're like, I, come I, on, I, I, you know? Whereas yeah. like, so it was just kind of stupid. They didn't put Boo or anybody. I think Nobody. Burst Limit 2 came out, but either way, at that point, we were still already fucking over it. They were just like, we've yeah, right. done we this done so many it. times. Yeah, we were done by then. Yeah. If you weren't playing Xenoverse, like that was it. Like, I after think Xenoverse came out way later too. Xenoverse came out like three or four years that, later. I couldn't even do that. 
Yeah, I couldn't. I, like, after I this, I was done. Like, like I was, I was good off of the Dragon Ball Z games. Yep. And I could tell they were they were drawing straws when they're like, you know what? Make your own character. <laughs> like, <laughs> create the story so we like, can figure okay. out how to do what we're gonna do no. next. But but I'm, then still go to the same stories. You just affect the same. Now story. you fight Raditz. Like, no, like, yeah. <laughs> no I don't want to see like, the story. No. <laughs> and like, here's the idea. Dragon Ball Z, by far, some of the greatest character design ever, period. You know what I mean? It literally Thank taught a, gr a generation of artists how to draw hair. Uh, <laughs> even non-artists how to draw hair. But like, for them to have the dopest character art ever, when they switched to like make your own character, I've never seen one that worked. You know what I mean? For some reason, there's something in the wrist of those artists that they <laughs> just can't pass off to a gamer. Cause it doesn't matter like the collection of or like combination of all these Saiyan hair, Saiyan armor, all that stuff. I've never seen one custom character that looks like they could have been in the series. It just never, right. it never oh. transferred. Cause I'm playing Jump Force right, right now. And I was like, this character is dope. No, it's not. My character was ass <laughs> and I made her. <laughs> I was you know, like, the thing about Dragon Ball's animation is just how they do black characters in general. like. Popo is straight trash. I don't know what he's supposed to be. And then just black characters in general, they always Call have me. It's like, why can't he just look like Goku in the face? Yo, like, love for real. You know what I'm saying? It's like, it's always it's the hey, man, get out of here. All those yep. in the street. They, they, did, draw, they did do the Jimmy Boo draw with us. They did do that. <laughs> Damn, I just thought about that. Like the little filler episodes when they go into town and stuff. Yep. Oh, like, oh my time. God, who are you with these They know good well lips. black people love Dragon Ball Z and the lips have not changed. In 2020, they still go in the city. Lips are like, I mean, <laughs> Oh no! Get out of here! Oh my god! <laughs> We're still just like ah, more super. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> you know, it's, I mean, it's still dope, but then it's like, oh dang! Like, SMA. there's no no black Z fighters. Ooh, See, this black. what we this this Ooh, what we need dope, to do. But then he's not canon. See, all we need to do is draw is do black <laughs> animes and draw white people see through. So like they there, <laughs> but they like the opacity turn out, so you can still kind of see behind them just so they feel some type of way. Or you can do like my story, I draw all white people that, to look like bread and loaves of bread. <laughs> like that's how my kids. Well, they do us dirty and then the thing is you get mad about it. They're like, oh, what's, what's the big deal? Get over it. It's like, <laughs> it's the only black character though. Like, he's right. the only black character. <laughs> Thought you wanted to be represented, <laughs> all right? Piccolo's black. Like, no, he's green. He's not. <laughs> black animated <laughs> lives matter. Sure. Big Fortune. facts. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that was Dragon Ball Z. I don't know how to say this other word, Budokai Tenkashi? Tenkaichi. Tenkaichi. Tenkaichi, three. Tenkaichi, yep. The show.